Now for Weather on the Ones with News 12 meteorologist Carrie Hall. Carrie, I love my job, but it was really, really hard to come in today. It's just so nice out. Yeah, Ted, you want to make sure you step outside any break you get yes. and just try to take it in because this is such a beautiful day and mm. it's so comfortable outside. A local lookout now over Stratford looks gorgeous and it's dry and many people just out and about with the windows down. You let the top down on the convertible or it's a great day to ride the bike as well. Now this weather unfortunately does not last. We are going to see some changes heading into the day tomorrow, so uh, a few more clouds mixing in and so far the rain holding off for a little while longer. We can see that there is a little bit of wet weather farther to the west of us and definitely a lot more clouds, so we can expect that heading into the evening and overnight hours. Look at these temperatures now 76 degrees in Norwalk, 78 in Reading and Stamford at 75 degrees Bridgeport now at 76. The normal high is about 69 degrees, so we're above that and lots of sun around 78 degrees at four o'clock. By 7 o'clock, it will be a very nice evening. A few more clouds filtering in 72 degrees and the clouds continue to increase by 10 o'clock tonight. We can see that on the forecast map, a pretty extensive cloud cover and there will be a chance of rain tomorrow around this time, so it won't be as bright and sunny and dry. In fact, the humidity creeping up and then we'll see some heavier rain heading into late Wednesday night into early Thursday and look at how widespread this rain gets. Nothing but rain all across the radar heading into the day on Thursday. Looks like it will be a washout at times, but then we'll have a couple of breaks during the afternoon. Not the best weather, but uh, here we go with some more rain. 51 degrees the low tonight in Wilton, Norwalk, a little of 53 degrees the next several days will be a bit unsettled with rain off and on a lot of clouds, highs in the upper 60s, but we get that all out of the way in time for the long holiday weekend. Highs in the low to mid 70s, bright sunshine. It looks absolutely gorgeous. I'll have another look at the hyperlocal forecast coming up.